Today I would like to elaborate a bit more on the energy efficiency with a particular focus on the merchant segment. Merchant shipping closely follows the trends of a global trade. The dramatic decrease in crude oil prices has significantly reduced the operating cost of the merchant vessel. Overcapacity in the existing fleet has driven down both freight and charter rates. This has again increased the cost-cutting pressure for owners and managers. From a merchant vessel bridge, the challenge has narrowed the view of the horizon from long term to short term. Merchant operators are instead aiming at the short term, quick payback time and investing only in what is most essential for their businesses. As the merchant segment has drastically reduced the investments in the new fleet, construction and new build, they are opting instead to use available vessel. The new specs and features can be retrofitted quickly, often offering a faster payback time compared to the new builds. Meanwhile, the demand for energy efficiency has risen dramatically, leaving older vessels far less efficient than the latest one. New standards in energy efficiency put pressure on the existing fleet to keep up on cost and energy efficiency. When retrofitting an existing fleet, selecting the right technology at the right time is vital. Some effective retrofitting examples in the merchant segments that focus only on one piece of equipment or several of those. Let's go now for a practical example. If routes emission profile are really different between winter and summertime, simply having a set of blades designed to meet those I mean, challenge and seasonal needs can greatly enhance the operation of your vessel. New equipment can make all the difference. By focusing on its efficiency throughout a vessel life cycle instead of a product life cycles, even old fleets can match the cost effectiveness of a newer fleet.